can't really judge, to be honest with you. Is my battery dying on this controller? That would suck if that happened. I always hated that the Xbox's uh, controller, when the battery's dying, it, the light on the controller spins. It's like it's always trying to be like, hey, the battery's dying. Look at me. Look at me down. It should just turn red. Like, the light should turn red. <laughs> your, your Xbox should do, like, a, a red ring of death. Be like, your battery's dying on your controller. And it's like, holy shit, red ring of death. It's like, no, it's just a battery dying. It's like, oh, okay. Why would they program that feature in? <laughs> Knowing that people would probably get confused that it might be the red ring of... Holy shit, the height on that. Oh, my gosh. Get out of here, you bat. Get out... I just died. What the freak? I think they went a little overboard with the see-through texture, just to think about it now. Uh, one of the Crash games that I used to play as a... I think I mentioned this in the Simpsons Hit and Run gameplay. If you watched that, probably not. But, uh, the one I used to play a lot as as a kid was the stupid one where you drive around in cars. The one where you're, um... One where you can get out of your car and you can walk around in, like, the theme park or whatever. Crash, like, tag team racing or something like that? I think that's the name of it. That's the one I played as a kid, and I remember somebody gave me this version of the game on the PS2, and I hated it, because I was like, because I couldn't beat one of the bosses as a kid, because I'm stupid, because I was dumb, and I'm like, how do you beat this boss? I can never beat him, and I rage quit. It was like the water boss, which I think is like the second worlds, so man, I'm really bad at video games at this rate. It's playing a remix version of the Crash Bandicoot theme. Hiya, got it. I hate that you always have to- I wish the stupid, like, arrow boxes you didn't have to break. Oh shit! Oh, come on, I can make that. How do you- how do you duck? Yeah! I can't make it. I'm gonna have to die. I'm gonna have to kill myself. I'm gonna have to kill myself just to get that stupid-ass box. That was sucked. I wasn't ready for that box placement. It's like an- it's like a medieval version of the Crash theme. Boop, 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 boop. But yeah, like a full 3D platformer in the Lego style. Come on, guys. I don't I don't know. Who, if I'm playing a game that's not Persona, it's just like my mind... Oh, shit. My mind's just like, we. My mind's just like, oh, what should I talk about? Oh, let's just talk about random ass shit. I have to think of something to talk about. I don't know. Make a, I don't want to be like... Alright, I did a jump. Uh, that was a nice jump I did there. Yeah, uh, we're going to have to collect more Wumpa Fruits here and uh, gather some Nitro Crates. Uh, yeah, we're gonna hit that box right there, do a ground pound on the exclamation point, uh, jump over here, uh, hit this box. I don't know. <laughs> I've always hated that. I forgot, there was, like, I've, I've mentioned this story so many times. There's, like, one YouTuber, I'm like, I really like this guy, because he had, like, informative commentary and all this other dumb shit, and then, like, he started making, like, all Dragon Ball Z content, and then all his commentary was like, Voom, wham, yeah, come here, come here, which I'm not going to say I don't do, because, you know, you get into the moment, and it's just like, it's over. It's over. You get into the moment of, like, comic high, high and, and shit like that. Are you not going to... Oh, I was about to say, you're not going to hit that box for me? Man, this makes it way easier. Isn't, like, in, like, Crash 1, like, if the boulder breaks the boxes, it doesn't count? Like, in the original PS1 game? <laughs> like, how, how sadistic are you, Naughty Dog? You're like, we're going to make this game challenging. If you can't hit the boxes yourself, they don't count. Dumbass. It's like, well, I wanted to get the boxes. I, oh, did I? Oh, no, I died in the bonus zone. That doesn't count, right? Because there's a death route in this area, right? Oh, shit. Man, he wants me. Why does Why does everybody chase me? Why does everything try to kill cr poor Crash Bandicoot? Crash Bandicoot did nothing wrong. He's just trying to enjoy his life. Enjoy a leisurely stroll through Crash Bandicoot land. Oh, shit. Wee! Checkpoint. Checkpoint reached. I think I did die. No, you have to... Oh, shit. You have to, like, die from a... You have to die from a non-checkpoint area, right? Something like that. Boop. Come on, baby, tell me... Why didn't it this TNT? But what the hell? That's weird. Why didn't... No, I didn't get the death route. What the freak? Come on. I need the death route. Gosh dang it. Now I'm gonna have to play the level again to get the dumb gym. How do they expect me to do that? This music's not that bad. That music ain't that bad. I give this music a 10 out of 10. Give me that gym. I give the music a 10 out of 10. And I give the soundtrack a 0 out of 16. It's like, why you gotta do that, Adam Sessler? Is that his name? I never watched G4. <laughs> Actually, I did I did try to watch G4 as a kid, and I, I uh... 
I could never catch it at the right time because it'd be like right when I got off of school. So I'd be like, it'd be like the, mo- it'd, be, it'd be like, oh no, I want to watch what Dr. Gaiman news is about. It's like, today we're going to review The Legend of Zelda Twilight Princess. Twilight Princess is the 17th installation in the Zelda series, and it is a new wave of entertainment. We give Crash Bandicoot 3 a 16 out of 12. For the sound design, at least. What happened to him? Didn't he, like, retire or something? He was, like, in, like, another... He went to, like, a... He, like, got fired... Like, G4 or whatever got, like, destroyed, which is coming back for some reason. That's great. Ooh, I got the Uka Uka mask. Look at me go. Look at me... You don't even go that fast. What the hell? I'm supposed to be super... Wait, if if I'm invincible, can I, like, tank a hit? Ooh, I'm still going fast. I'm still going fast, baby. I'm still invincible. You can't stop me. You can't stop this man. Why don't we just collect three Uka Uka masks and go fight the final boss right now? Yeah, that uh, that music for the invincibility doesn't have the same weight or impact the other version of it does. You know, it's like boop blah blah boop 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 boop. I want that life. Oh, it doesn't count because I didn't hit the box myself. Because that's how video games work. Wee! You didn't see that, did you? You didn't see that coming, did you, baby? Wee! Look, I'm having fun playing Crash Bandicoot, getting chased by a dragon. Getting chased by a big old dragon. They didn't see? Easy game. Easy game. Why? It's like this game was made for kids or some bullshit like that. No, this is a hardcore platformer made for serious, serious adult gamers. Like me. I'm a serious adult gamer, ready to challenge the world. Actually, can't wait for Crash Bandicoot 4. It's about time. It should be called Wrath of Cortex for real this time. You know, just be an asshole about it. And Traveler Sales like, what the fuck, guys? Come on, guys. Like, the senior executive there still, like, works there. And he's like, I, I helped make uh, Crash Wrath of Cortex. I actually put my heart and soul into that game. I actually was really pumped about making that game. But no, I just get shit on every time. We found two gems in the first, like, five stages. That means, like, the last two gems are in the last area of the game. What's even the point of collecting all the apples? There's like an apple counter in like the new one. Green! I got the big green gym! Compactor reactor! It rhymes! That makes it good! I thought this game was in widescreen. Apparently not. I'm playing it off the good old fashioned Xbox. I already made that joke. Hey, when you do commentary, <laughs> you kind of forget the things you say. And you kind of do that voice again, even though you don't mean to. Uh, that's for uh, my uh, Persona playthrough. I don't think I can get the gym here because I need a special gym or some bullshit like that. Oh no, fire. Oh uh, yeah, I love the cart sections. Yeah, you need the yellow gym. That makes sense. The good old fashioned yellow gym to get into like a, an area like that. Whee! Uh oh. How do you know you're going the right way? How do you know you didn't miss any boxes? What if I missed all the boxes? I gotta collect all the boxes. It makes me feel like I. Uh, it makes me feel like I've achieved something in my life, in my small, very pitiful life. I gotta achieve something, and if that's collecting all the crates in Crash Bandicoot, well, damn it, I'm gonna do it. Hell yeah, easy game. Look at this, easy. Woo! I say that now. I don't think I ever collected the gems as a kid because I didn't know that you could. I didn't know breaking all the boxes would get you anything. Uh, this was before I was uh, on YouTube, and like people were like, "If you break all the boxes, you get the you get the gems," and I'm like, "Okay." I don't know. I didn't know that as a kid. You think I'm aware of that? Hit all the TNT boxes, because apparently they don't explode. It's like the weakest ass explosion. Wee, you missed. Come on, what is this? The compactor react? Ah, oh, what the hell? What is this? The compactor reactor? Kabam! Oh shit. I always found it satisfying uh, breaking all the breaking all the boxes. Woo! How did I? Oh my gosh! I, I I somehow tanked a hit. I somehow survived that hit without getting hurt. Hey, I'm taking it. Why is this guy just on the conveyor belt spraying his liquids everywhere? He shouldn't be doing that. He shouldn't be doing that. This is a kids' game. He can't be doing that kind of shit. You sicko! Wee! Hit it. What does this do? It makes all the boxes come out. Wee! Get it. Come on, baby. Woo! Easy game. I just really think that they should make a new Crash Bandicoot. Crash Band... I don't know what... There's, like, certain times where I'll, like, get re... Oh, shit, I just need to go. Wee! I just need to get the hell out of there. Oh, easy. Oh, shit, I fucked that up. One, two, three, 
four, one, two, three, four, five. Sink that asshole. Oh shit, I didn't mean to do that. Oh my gosh, the freaking boxes spawned right beneath my feet. Holy shit. 33, got it. I just don't know, like, I have already, like, 33 lives. Holy shit. There's no way I'm gonna waste this opportunity. There's no way I'm gonna... It's just, I, like... Anytime I, like, play, like, these old games, I'm like, oh my gosh, that reminds me of my childhood. I used to play, like, used to watch, like, Yu-Gi-Oh! and shit like that. It was amazing. I loved watching Yu-Gi-Oh! I loved watching Yu-Gi-Oh! It was the greatest freaking thing in the entire world. They used to play shitty ass cards and I'd be like, oh my gosh, they just played a they just played Exodia, holy shit. I really wish I didn't delete all the footage for me playing that one game, but the audio for it, I got hit from the one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five. Anyway, what I was gonna say is I got hit by that like compressor. Like, it wasn't even, like, sat down or anything like that, and it counted it, that as a hit. That's bullshit. What's the point in having enemies in this game? There should just be, like, little platforming segments, not, like, these dumbass, like, enemies just like, herpty derp, I'm just standing right here. I think when you, uh, it's like, <laughs> it's like vehicles, and like a, whatever you call a game. It's like freaking traffic, and like Simpsons hit and run. It shouldn't be there. Why is it even there? Oh shit, the game's loading. Oh shit, don't want that Xbox chugging. Don't want that Xbox to give off, like, radiation heat. Hell yeah, I got everything. Booyah, baby. Now we get to fight the boss. Yay, the rumble in the rocks. The worst boss ever. This is the worst boss ever. I really wish that this boss would just jump off a cliff. Come on, Biff. You could have done a lot better. Did he get any other roles besides Back to the Future? Did he? Was he ever in anything else? Dude, Crunch and like other Crash Bandicoot games, he just becomes Mr. T. He's like, ah, pity the fool. I, th I think I started in freaking tag team racing. He's like, ah, pity the fool that does this shit. It's like, okay, Mr. T, chill out. It's like Universal's like, yeah, I really don't know what to do with this game. This game character, he looks like a lot like Mr. T, doesn't he? Hey, get them, uh, get them guys over there to make it look like he's more like Mr. T. Oh great, my favorite boss. The one where you hit the rocks and you hope to god it hits. Where you hit the blue rocks and make them blue and then you- then you- it hits him. And that's how you make a good boss fight. That's how you make a good- there's a map in this area? What the freak? Oh shit, let me get that one. I need to get this one. Over here, there. Hold on. Listen, it's not good with this isometric view thing. Get it. This is the dumbest boss fight in every- in- it is the dumbest boss fight that any video game has ever made. I don't understand. It's just like, duh, hit the rocks and make the make the make the make them hit the big rock. It's like okay, and then they keep adding more rocks, and then he can hit the rocks and he can hurt you. Isn't that sound like fun times? It's like a shitty ass marble game. Why? Yeah, he can hit them and mess it up for you. Wait, I didn't know that could happen. I didn't know that if I was sparked up like that, it could hurt me. Oh shit. No, none of that. Aha, blue! I have 37% health. Aha, another blue one. Where's the last one at? Where's might be- never mind, I have to get two more now. This is so... Dumb. Come on, just get the last one. I hate that he can reset them. Son of a bitch, stop it. Stop it. They should put this one in Crash Bandicoot 4. <laughs> I don't know why that voice is funny. Ow. 19% health. I got this. Just get that stupid rock over here. There we go. I have 19. Why is Crash has like the weirdest like face model ever? Duh. <laughs> Duh. I'm so happy. I'm so happy to be a Crash Bandicoot right now. Hell yeah. It just feels real damn good to be a damn Bandicoot. I remember when I figured out that he, he was made by Cortex. I'm like, wow, that's interesting. It's like, is it? It's like, not really. It's kind of like a, it's kind of a typical cartoony thing that you, the main antagonist makes their downfall. Give me that rock. I need them rocks, damn it. Why couldn't we have like a plat, the next boss is a platforming boss, not this one. I'm like, why can't we have a good old fashioned platformy boss? Instead of this bull crap. We so much fun. Give me that, yeah, we win. Easy. Easy. You led to your own demise, you idiot. I win. I win a thousand dollars to me. Give me that new power up. Hold that button while moving. 
to sneak along suspended nitro crates. Hold that button. Yay, we get the ability to walk on nitro crates, but not normally walk on nitro crates. No, that'd be too good of a power up. We can sneak across them now. And that's gonna be used like for like two levels. <laughs> and two levels to do the one to do this. Doop to do. I'm sneaking across the stupid things. Cortex! Yeah, when's it gonna do anything? Come on, man. Fight back. I wanna play the game. <laughs> oh no, I gotta save, because this game doesn't auto-save. It's one of those old video games that never auto-saves. Save game. Uh, I had 64%, hell yeah. How did I get 64%? Did I did I do it? Save game? Yeah, I did it. What were the other names for my characters? Load game? Crash, Crash, and Crash. I'm glad I had some original names there. I always like that. It's like when you played like original Zelda and it was like, put your name in. And it's like, we would we would all have our names and there'd be like three save files with like all our names. And it'd be like, this guy has like 20 hearts. Did, did what's his face also sign a contract that said you had to be in the platoon movie or whatever the hell? And, and you had to be in a Crash Bandicoot game eventually? I would love like I would love these like stupid idea of this like contracts you sign and just like in like small ass prints like you also will have to do a voice acting uh, stunt as a, a in a children's video game too doesn't that sound like fun it's like no it doesn't I remember this level I remember why is it so wide when you start out never mind why is it so wide like that here we're going to the water why is the water so deep Jesus. There's no, there's no, there's no uh, death path in this area, please. This one. Oh my gosh, the thing, the bridge collapsed. They did put a lot of effort into this game. Is this the game that Traveler's Tales made before the Lego games? Warner Brothers is like, hey, we'll take Traveler's Tales for you. They, they ain't doing nothing. Let's make them make a stupid Star Wars game. Let's see what happens. It's like, oh, everyone loves Lego Star Wars. Lego Indiana Jones. It's like, everyone kind of like that one. It's okay. Uh, n another Lego Star Wars? It's like, yeah! Lego Harry Potter? Yeah! Lego Indiana Jones 2? Oh no! <laughs> I got that game for Christmas one time, when I was younger, when I had a Wii or whatever. So like, in like, elementary school or whatever, and it was like, um... It was like, so bad. It was so bad, I got it for Christmas and I beat it, like, the day I got it. And I was like, this game is so bad. Like, it's one of those games where I'm like... I don't know, it's just like, something's wrong about it, like... I, I wanna like I wanna like it, but it's just like uh Like it's just it's just one of those feelings you get as a kid, you know, you're like, oh my gosh. I wanted the I didn't want the game. It's just like a game you it's just a game you get. It's one of those things where it's like they give it to you and you're like, oh this is nice. But you're just a kid too, so you're like, oh it's cool you know, video game and you put it in and you play it and you beat it and you're like that wasn't satisfying at all. That was kind of annoying to be honest with you. I think that is like the lowest rated like Lego game ever. Well, like Lego Indiana Jones 2. It's like, is there really a point to this game? It's pretty much just they added the like Lego, they added like Crystal Skull to it. They added freaking Crystal Skull, the greatest game, the gr greatest, the greatest freaking Indiana Jones movie. I've never seen, I've seen like one. I've never fully watched any of the Indiana Jones movies besides the first one. And I was like, this is a fun movie. I like it. But after that, I'm like, I don't know. I'll maybe watch them again. Maybe. I'll think about it. You gotta, like, you gotta, like, set me up for it. I'd rather play Uncharted. Why can't they make an Indiana Jones game? That seems like an easy thing to make. It's just, like, give it to, like, a, a developer and be like, hey, make an Indiana Jones game. Why not? Make it like a, Make it like that there Uncharted game there. <laughs> I can't believe the the executives for whatever big corporation just are like some rednecks. Make it like their, uh, that there. Look, it's the Nitro Crate walk we can do now. I don't know why they didn't make it so it's like, you get these special boots and now Nitro Crates will act like TNT crates now. They'll like, kind of like maybe like start a self-destruct sequence. It'd be like, that's cool. That's a cool idea. That's a good reward because then it can make like speed running levels fun. Like, because you wouldn't have to worry about like... You wouldn't have to worry about the stupid things like triggering or whatever when you're running through it. You know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm talking about. Can't do that voice no more. It's 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 messed up. Two, three, four, five. Wee! Boop. Got it. 
all 49 of them big boxes is in my I put all them broken ass box pieces in my little pockets he has a tail oh, does he have a tail no he doesn't have a tail I thought he had a tail I'm like what the freak Crash Bandicoot doesn't have a tail hey you have to actually hold the accelerate button in this in this area I had no idea that when I first played this game as a kid so I was always like I was always like oh my gosh why am I why am I always slower than the rhinos it doesn't make any sense why are the rhinos? Why do rhinos always catch up with me? It, it, it's just so odd and strange. Oh, give me that one life. Hell yeah. Do we're racking up the lives? It's like this game is hard or something like that. Oh shit. It's like this game is, has some like some steep ass difficulty curve eventually. Hey, I love games that. Oh shit! No, go back. Go back. Turn around. Turn around. Turn around. No, no. Don't get another checkpoint. Don't get it. Can you like beat me already? Oh, I'll just fall down this. Woo! I got smushed. Crash didn't get smushed there for a second. All right, we got to keep it slow. Keep it slow. Got to get them crates. Got to get them. Yeah, there we go. Woo. Okay, now we can go. I really wish I could see, but that's beside the point. I like that they put a box right there before the rhino spawn. So it's like, it's like, uh oh, you missed a box. Derp. <laughs> you missed a box right before the thing happened. Oh, looks like you're going to have to kill yourself and do it again. Who put all these nitro crates everywhere? Who put all these? Why are there, why is there just three boxes stacked? Woo. They're just like three nitro crates stacked up against each other. It's like, why would you do that? Who who has a nitro crate fetish? Who's like, dude, I'm going to add so many nitro crates to this game. They ain't going to see it coming. It's like those like hack videos. There's like some like random ass like hack videos of like Crash Bandicoot 1 or 2 or whatever you call it. And it's just like they add like 20,000 nitro crates and like 16,000 TNT crates. You're just like, oh my gosh, what the hell is going on? Doesn't this level seem like fun? It's like, no, it doesn't. Not at all.